good evening. I see you finished all of your apples. I'm glad you're feeling well enough to eat. You've been so worried about it. The fever was so severe. The weather certainly wasn't open. It's been cold and rainy for days. It's much easier to Back to Dipper. The rain is soothing. Pink's being in here to a warm and cozy. Do you think? Perhaps. I'll refill your basket. them this morning from the market. Only the finest for you. I should give you your medicine before it gets too late. Yes, the moon has been in the sky for quite some time. Your strength during this illness has been truly remarkable. A testament to this illness. Of course, I was worried about your condition. Not as much as my sister. But I knew right from the start. Seeing how far you've come makes us both so proud. Absolutely. It's been so inspiring to witness your progress. Like watching the first light of dawn chase away the darkness. Shine so brightly. We're both so grateful.
Are there any chills or aches? your fever to alleviate some discomfort. There's a bit of magic in garlic. It somehow eases congestion. Let it sit for a moment. I find it works better when it has a chance to breathe after being crushed. Is that so? I usually administer it right after crushing. Yes. I discovered this by accident recently. I was tending to a patient. Silky, who had been sick for weeks, made a full recovery the next day. Normally, it takes about four servings to achieve that level of wellness. We tested it again, so we had this also. Something strange happened. Doesn't surprise me. You don't seem like the type to shy away from challenges or unpleasant things. A noble quality. A noble quality indeed. It's not so bad.
sweet thing. Makes me sad to see you in pain. But the silver lining is that you finally get to rest, which is so important. Even the strongest, tallest trees in the forest need the support. for the garlic. Swallow this quickly. If it lingers in your mouth for too long, it can come right back up. And we wouldn't want that. Good. Chill on these mint leaves. You will remove that taste. Be as good as new tomorrow. Hopefully. Kettle is ready.
do it when my patients are asleep, but I think it's needed right now. Just relax your mind. Let everything go blank. Focus on the feeling of your left hand. Allow it to relax completely. As if you could remove it, even if you wanted. Shift your focus to your right hand. Still complete. Just like that. into the sound. Your body and mind. 
so dedicated and hardworking. But now is the time to rest and sleep. Good night. Good morning, sunshine. How do you feel? Feel that? The sunshine. So warm and comfortable. We've been through so much the last few days. I've experienced fevers before, but nothing is acute. So glad you came to us when you did. Tempting to recover from something like that alone could have been unsuccessful. Every time I recuperate from illness, I feel a renewed sense of gratitude. Those moments of struggle, when the body and mind are tested, the life feels precious again. Such a pleasure to walk with you. The most satisfying part of my job is getting to watch my patients make a full recovery. As you have. It makes all the worry you. Especially in the spring. It's the sound of the earth waking up from a deep slumber. You really have the most lovely demeanor.
come with me? I'll make you some soup before you head off on your travel. 